What is happening? This is 60% can't. And uh, we're playing a Minecraft world once again. What are these strangers? Why do they look at me such a way? And is there something outside? What are you look? Oh, sorry to interrupt you. Anywho, so I was doing some breeding with these people. Yes, Minecraft is that kind of game. All you gotta do is give these people random shit. Like, this guy likes raw pork chop. He's real freaky. He'll hand you an emerald or you know some coal. You know he's got to do some barbecuing. What's this guy got? He wants paper because he is a librarian. Totally makes sense, I know. Well, uh, I was doing some trading. When you give them trading, they fall in love with each other and they do not have genders. So they fork everybody senselessly. So I've created this fork senselessly chamber of sorts. It is in the shape of a rectangular pyramid. And just so happened, this is where the village was, and it was a, kind of a, this rectangle, and my last village, all my villagers died, so I wanted to protect them. And what better way than the fireproof wood shell you see before you? Uh, yeah, wood maybe wasn't the best choice, but uh, luckily, you know, monsters don't, they don't have torches, they don't burn things down, they don't have flint and steel. Anyways, this is where the well was. It's also the best escape route. So this is like a uh, expansion base, sort of. Mostly just, of course, to breed villagers. But you yeah, have a lot of inventory there. And look, you can see one of the houses this is like a church or something. But yeah, zombies can still go through the doors. They can bust open doors, I guess, sometimes. I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of poking out that pyramid a little bit. And so is that house. Oh, horsey. I finally found my saddle. I was going to use them, but I have this convenient railway here. Should I do it? Should I? Well, I originally was going to bring some inventory across this railway. But I think I've got the most I need to get. Just need to use the cobblestone because I'm building a lot of stuff and just some junk. There's not even a place to. It's not like lava, the trash things over here, so. Gotta take out the trash. So most of the time I would just travel across this mountain, sometimes on a horse, but a lot of times on foot. And I finally created a railway tunnel. And does it make sense that you could run on a minecart? This rendering's a little janky. There's a pig! Oh my god. And there he goes. I miss you. Oh shit. What's even happening? What does N stands for? Well, I'll tell you. It stands for the night. Actually, it stands for north. It's the way of north. And as you can see, there's hills rendering before you. And if you look behind you, you'll see some redstone torches. Oh uh, wow, another tunnel. Is this Indiana Jones? There's something so relaxing about a endless tunnel. And pet and awfully terrifying. And as you can see an octopi was frolicking in the lake. <laughs> Preposterous. Hey there's some lava. Uh, I probably shouldn't have been able to see that. Well you know. Oh god. There is no end, isn't there? It's a foolish trap. End this stairs like in Mario 64. Hey, that's my failed village I was just talking about. Everybody died. Except three people. Do you call them people? I don't think so. They make strange sound. They pissed me off. I turned off their volume. Oh look, another pyramid. What do you know? Is there a thing coming? Yes, it's a mostly rendered pyramid. And we skid off into the grass right there. <laughs> you hear that sound? I gotta get that, that volume up. You hear the scuttling in the grass and the such. Master volume. So yes, it's a stone pyramid. 
wow, it's, it feels so great just to walk up to it. I just, I kind of wish it existed. That would be really awesome. Yeah, I was experimenting with some window designs. I still can't quite decide. I thought this was going to look way cooler. It actually looks cooler on the inside. I didn't even look at it on the inside. Actually, I like how it looks on the inside. On the outside, it doesn't look very good. I think it's white tinted glass. So yes, this chamber is just my atrium of, it's a kind of garden, I guess you could say. I'll grow some trees and hope to keep growing, quote unquote, this patch of dirt in a spiral up, up, up the pyramid. Oh, you can finally see up there. That's a usefulness for windows. As you can see, many colored sheep have invaded my atrium but i'll let them stay it might be safer for them in there <laughs> than out here monsters lie in the night there's some warning signs it's some of the stone stuff yeah i don't know creepers blow up around here this in my mind looked way cooler in my head this wall is protecting a chasm not even that bad of a chasm i was trying to do a thing with like flowing water down there oh no it's gonna mess up the look that's fine it's not very attractive anyways i must use dirt out of desperation this is also a pyramid but this is also a friendly warning as you know in minecraft there are many chasms Rhythm. oh wow Oh, fuck! Oh, what hit me? Oh, fucking schnaich and schwuchen. Good thing I have pretty good armor. Oh my god, it's swarming! Usually, threat of death is not really common in Minecraft. Ah, I'm channel to another chasm. Ah. Yeah. Dropped a carrot. Whoa, buddy. Don't put me in there. Oh, you little piece of shit. This is more annoying than anything. I put you on fire. Okay. I swear I'm better than this. It's just like... With the, with the recording and everything, it's just kind of like choppy. Excuses, excuses. Where did this get? This is a new guy. Motherfucker. Wow, that was like kind of clutch in a way. I wasn't expecting that. Another one. Oh, the sound kind of. It's just like too much. Just let me uh, take it down a little bit. Gotta get that mother ucka before I can come back up. I'll take your experience points again. Where do you go? Wow, that was... That was clutch. <laughs> Not really, but... Oh, wow, that's pretty deep. I was kind of aiming for the water. I think, you know, it's been a while since I played, so maybe my, like, reaction time is a little... Not as good. Wow, more excuses. Wow. Oh, that chewy. Chewing, chewing all day long. I hope I don't get by another skeleton or something like that. That would be a, not good. I can rise up the waterfall. I honestly should plug this up, you know? Ah. I'm not going to, but I'm trying to get a platform. How fast that digs. What efficiency is this? Holy shit. <laughs> oh, I heard that sound. Oh, no. At least it's more obvious of a chasm. I said this is a friendly warning, but not friendly enough, huh? Errard. Wow, spiders. Three balls of experience points. This, this place has such a vibe at the night, doesn't it? Let us continue forward, past what the space that does not render. It is a stairway to hell. 
It's a great color uh, combination going on there with the sheep. Yeah. In space. Sheep in space. Maybe that's what's dropping my rendering capability. Like, you can see, there's a building right here. Okay. I'm just going to let it chill there. And I like to see if monsters come by, too. So then I know something wasn't lit properly. Oh, there you go. We might have came from far away. I don't even know. I'm sorry, Mr. Orange Sheep. Although I do frequent slaughterings of them. You gotta cut down the numbers when they keep breeding all the time. It's, okay, I, I'll confess. I use, I use the sheep for experience points. I breed them for experience points. And then I slaughter them for experience points, for mutton, for their colored wool, and to cut down their numbers. Because sometimes it gets low rendering like this. Although this is just because I'm recording. Oh yes, I always forget about this structure. It's surprisingly large for how how fast it was erected. Hey, get the frack out of here. I shan't be harassed during when I'm roaming around my own grounds. It's funny, I'm not used to coming from the pyramid base getting here so fast because usually I had to walk you can see where we just treaded through a little garden of colored sheep how quaint indeed it's a dark hills we don't, we don't talk about the shadowlands yes the stair keeps going but oh yeah Yes, the main fortress right now. Still rendering. It's the current width. It's still... Top is not finished of this width. The original width was like right here. So that's where all those windows are. So I have no windows on this side yet. And so yeah, that's like the top right there. Barely see it. And it should go about that high and probably taper off. Um, I actually kind of want some cool, like, swoop hanging down, some sort of curve, or when you get this, when you get to that size of structure, it's, uh, it's difficult to get the right curves. Oh, fuck, look at that creeper. He's just chilling there like he owns the place. Gotta take down that mother -ucka. Maybe as we proceed high, we'll be able to perceive higher. Yes, yes. And I was thinking about more water elements, huh? Like, coming maybe on the inside. Man, there's so many, that's what she says, I keep saying, but I'm not gonna, like, say that all the time. But I'm thinking it, okay? You know, of course, it seems now. I'm honestly afraid to accidentally make this a phallic. I have to worry about that. I don't think it's that troublesome. I mean, a tower is a tower. You can you can get that creative if you want to be for like anything. So, but either way, I don't want just some simple silo. Like, I've liked how I used shapes and stuff. Maybe there could be like arms coming off of this thing. I've always liked the theme of octop octopus. And uh, you know, I think of Atlantis too when I'm doing these kind of things. But it's not like. There's Atlantean architecture I could reference from. Well, they most likely did use pyramids. If you got those underwater pyramids and such. Yeah, I think some arch, arch, like, arms coming out would help the negative space here. I always want to kind of like a ball, like, oh, fuck. I should have saw that coming. Oh, nice, Wolfie! Great job. Where the fuck did you come from? Are you just sitting? I didn't know. The, I didn't know the attack when they were sitting. That's great. I didn't get more of those. I didn't know that happened. Usually, when I bring them, I accidentally kill them, which is sad. I don't. Know why I'm shooting monsters. It's not really. Let's see. You want some mutton? I guess it doesn't really do anything giving it to you without. 
a significant other. Would you like to see the inside? Oh, there's another wolfie. Yes, it goes down a bit, too. What do you know? It's close to the bottom. Damn, did it take so long to dig that up? I was determined, though. But I still need something to do with it. I was thinking, like, um, little bridges down here. Ah, oh, vines would be cool. Or you think of, like, Zora's Domain and Ocarina of Time. Just the vibe of that place. That place used a lot of vertical space. And it had a large waterfall. See, I got water coming from... This actually comes from... Uh, I don't think there's actually a, just a normal source. I think it's just the end right here. But you got this coming to the bottom. And also on this side as well. This one actually comes from this like made-up river that I made. Oh, it definitely needs to be a bridge right here. Okay. We can we can build it. Get some water. Placid Lake. <laughs> oh, do you see the little fucker just hanging out there? It feels like it's funny. They don't even need to be like harmful. I feel like just because he's like being sneaky. Well, I guess I wouldn't care about him as much if he didn't blow stuff up. So he always got to take out creepers. I think I can kill them in one shot. Yeah, with the fire. Is this oh, power five? Yes, righteous top level bow right there. I think the only thing that can make it like way more ultimate would be inf infinity. But I used to think that was OP. And then I couldn't find Infinity on this playthrough. I couldn't. On a different one I did. So I assumed it was easier to get. And then I never thought that I could live without it. But then, I always thought arrows were like <laughs> tedious or difficult to make. like Or needed a resource that was difficult, to, tedious to get. But it wasn't. It's not at all. Flint, especially with an efficiency shovel. You can get a ton of flint off gravel. And then, uh, and then chickens, it's easy to breed them and get a lot of feathers. And then sticks, of course. It's not bad at all. It's fun to have a place that has variety, yet similar theme. This is a little wheat garden. Almost see. I don't want to jump on. Okay, it's okay. Yeah, it should be open. I think it's open. I think it's rendered. Possibly. Might go a little higher than that. But I need to do something with this. See, I like to have enough of large of a hole that's an empty space in the middle. So you can kind of see coming down. But as it gets. Wait, wait, wait. Mm. But you want levels, too, where you have content. It was, I realized just having a tower that you just go up to is not really that cool. It's alright, but... So content takes, usually, horizontal space. Actually, this... My quote-unquote castle fortress has, like, no content. <laughs> has no, like, rooms with themes and stuff like that. It's mostly I'm interested in shape. Man, it's so fun to like see things of vantage points. Yeah, this is where I go down here to um get diamonds, go down tunnels. There's all sorts of tunnel ways down here. A 
Because I could eat as well. But we'll just head right back up. Probably go to the top of the construction going on. Well, perhaps, well, no, I very well should deposit the stuff that I have and trash the stuff I don't need, which I thought was a lot of stuff. I don't, I can't do anything with leather. I guess I could color it, but I don't really care about that. They would be hard to get. I wish you could take the leather off. That would be awesome. Yeah, and these crappy bows, you really can't use them. Should be it, huh? Deposit the rest of the stuff. Oh, hi! That was kind of scary. A lot of the cobblestone. And th that clears out pretty quick when I'm building uh, big stuff like this place. I got a book that I bought. What was it? Aqua Affinity? Yes, love it. Some decent armor. Which I'm. Was I? No. I'm breaking two. Projecting all three. Whew, well this one's way better. In fact, I really gotta keep it going. Before it breaks. So, let's do that, huh? Unfortunately, I have a pretty high number of experience points right now. Which I usually like to save for enchantments. But this is pretty essential. Because this is a, quite a decent armor. Well, it depends on the cost, I guess. I don't know if I've... <sighs> so to get near full... Yeah, I don't think that's... That's not much at all. I think it's totally worth it. It'd be a lot harder to get that level of enchantment again. Protection 4. Like, that's really... That's really the quality in that piece. So, I'll go for it. Feather falling? Mm, muy excelente. So, it took a lot of experience, but that's okay. I don't think I was saving up for anything else. I have some decent stuff right now. <sighs> Actually, yeah, I pretty much just want to sustain what I have. <sighs> Damn! Okay, I didn't realize how awesome... I mean, pretty much my boots are the only thing that's not, like, amazing. But they're not bad, either. Feather falling, I mostly have all the time just for building stuff. I really want to get rid of this armor. It's rather tacky. I'll just freaking trash. I feel like I shouldn't trash anything, if, but then I feel like a hoarder. It's got to have a use later at some point. I'm going to put it. I have deeper storage of these. And what a great occasion to show you. Oh, look at this map. It's all these places. This is the jungle. This is where the kitty cats are. If you go north, 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 through these islands, there's also some, like, there's these chain of islands that I have little, all bridges to, and that's to gain the cat, which I did once. I took the cat all the way across here, took forever through this mesa biome. The mesa biome has very little, but it has a couple things. It's like a pyramid right here. And then there's... Is there a complete bridge right here? No, I think it only goes out a little bit. That's a, that's a project to do, actually. That's kind of important. Eggs and mutton. <laughs> that's where my glowstone is. Just gonna put this in the quote-unquote attic. How about that? Catch me outside. Okay, blocks of coal. Definitely need to deposit that. While I'm up here, I'll just go ahead and show you the rest. Got a, you know, jump man right there. Some, it's the art gallery. I would ideally like to turn this to my library. Oh yeah, it was something outside the window. I need to get. I think if there's a floating like, maybe they're floating diamond or floating ball right there. Freaking awesome. I thought for the longest time I was going to have a central floating crystal kind of looking thing. It used to be like right there. 
But it just it wasn't it didn't work, I guess. Oh man. Oh, I think this is a stairwell to get rid of. It's really blocking the view. That might be worth doing right now, huh? Don't fall. It's beautiful. Yeah, this is an old stairway. It's right above. It's blocking a lot of view. And that is a platform, an old platform. Though well, it's not a bad one to use, because maybe I could go into that, the dirt area and make a little like room of sorts. Content is important. And this is a big blaring hole, but... Oh yeah, that's where the, pla the platform is. I need an alternate way to get to that place because I don't. I don't think it's worth totally wrecking. It's nice to view. Oh shit! Is this how high this? Oh, oh damn. Okay, so this is high as the stairs go. So to get to the top, I actually have to build blocks. So that's probably why this is incomplete. Well, not necessarily. Do have 64 blocks, so I will show you the top. Get to where I want to get. This might actually look bad on the outside, but. Here we go. Go down here. Can always remove these later, right? Yeah, it's a bit of ways up there. Huh? Could almost run the blocks. There we go. Nice, nice. So this is the construction zone right now. But it's definitely a little too too straight, huh? But that's you can work with that. Oh, what if I had like a segment coming off of here? What if somehow this reached all the way over there? That would be awesome. Maybe waterways would be good. Something to do with that. Wow, so many possibilities. Yeah, just something to break up the. Uh, the monotony of the straightness right here. If there's like tubes, like you know, intersecting, or or even as this top kind of curves in a different way, either up at a slant, you know, up to there, kind of, or even it like like that with a slant with some stuff hanging off the edge, down, you know, at an angle. Pretty righteous, and I guess this stairwell is old. Yeah. And I can't reach that up there. It's basically the highest you'll get. Did I get a good look? Whoa! Well, it doesn't render very far. And even if I boost up the render rendering distance, it's probably not going to get much more. Look at that fucking glass. It's crazy. Wow, all this stuff needs to get cleared. But uh, I'll just do some of it right now. Just a, a morsel of sorts. I gotta use my uh, fortune pickaxe on these glowstone. Make sure I get the most glowstone back. Only got two, motherfucker. It takes four to make one. And fortune is an enchantment for your pickaxe. It lets you get more of things when you pick from them. But it's still random, the amount. I'm glad this place is lit up enough that no monsters get me. Oh boy. Oh yeah, the breaking stuff. Yes. If I wanted to, I could use a silk touch pickaxe, or I think that's the only thing that can have silk touch. And any block like glass, which normally breaks when you pick it, you can get it back. Wow, yay. Is this the end of the stairwell? Oh no, it's over there. This is a different stairwell. Holy tits. This place is like a maze. Okay, that's nice. Gets us some space. Uh, it's gonna be open, that's all right, whatever. 
make sure I don't run off the edge or nothing. Whoa! It's very scary. Very nice. And these windows will stay even though they might not be used. That is all right. Oh shit. Let's see if I can mend that a little bit. Yes, whatever, just do that. I'd rather be enclosed. Oh shite. Nothing like erasing stairs right behind you. And this goes to the old, the old tower. Oh wow! I I have had so many close calls this past like minute. Quite lucky. You're deleting floor underneath you, but I guess it's pretty wise to make sure you're. I'm not falling the fuck off. I don't know if axes are supposed to be used on glass. I've always used them on it. They seem to work pretty well. Just get that one! Eat it! Oh, shit. I actually don't know the best way to get this. Okay, well, that'll work. Oy vey, this is not gonna work very well. Oh, like maybe like that? Is that? Monster? No. Oh, minecart. Crap. Okay, this is not as as criminal to have. I think I could probably reach it. Oops. But maybe not. <laughs> of course not. Oh, what do I do this? Of course. There we go. It can be done. I like clearing the empty space. It's very nice. I just lets you see more the expansion of the inside. I suppose the top floor should be its own level. So even if it got larger at the top. Flat that is. I guess maybe some triangles would good do good. <laughs> I'm laughing because I just made this connection. I am designing this character for this game I'm making, and uh, part of their character flaw, character development, whatever, is that they're constantly designing. And they're always finding fault at things, and they're always coming up with like odd uh, design combinations and telling their significant other about them. It's like, oh, Jerry, look at that horrid uh, hound's tooth with lace on the wall. Oh, something that actually would be normal. <laughs> but then she would suggest something weird like hound's tooth and lace. What would be better would be polka dots with the flower petals. Turning into robots, wouldn't you say? And then the, the significant other's like, yeah, sure, whatever. Just trying to shut her up all the time. <laughs> and my connection was that I was like, wow, I'm the one saying like weird ass things as designs. I'm like, wow, that'd be a tube out of there or a flat or <laughs> when I said a triangle, that's, that's when it hit me. Is embarrassed, but also uh, aware now. That's quite an odd place right here. Ah, oh, shite. This is the top. Yes. Must bust that. Stone, but not that one that's next to the glass. No, I can do that one. That's okay. Jumping jackrabbits. All right. 
This is top. Okay. Sort of. And granted, that has to be busted out too, but when this tower gets higher, then it'll be easier to do that. And that's what I will do that. So, I have a lot of stone, so I can't do much building. But maybe what I can do is make like the beginnings of something and see from afar if that looks like that'd be cool. Now I'm feeling over here, honestly something lower, like starting from a lower position, like an arm, yeah, like somehow relating to this structure over here and kind of going where this is kind of growing. <laughs> Did not mean to rhyme there. But yeah, maybe even where this part is, if it, if it grew outward. Outward and upward. So I have to give it some thickness, like two blocks. Oh shit. Okay. There goes my legs. Broken legs. Not quite. So, in this video, I haven't showed you these guys yet. So these are like kind of tentacle arms, you could say. Yep. I saw just a crazy, like, square pattern in the sky for a second. I don't know if that was the sunshine or what. Um, yeah, they look a little vanilla, don't they? Maybe the little glass helps. They need, like, streaks or something. They're just, like, spotted with the glowstone. Glowstone's important. Maybe we could accentuate on those glowstone. Maybe make, like, flowery or, like, explosive like star shapes coming out of them with a different color maybe like red okay here this connects to this walker right here oh even i can come out from here it could be like a grand bridge oh, i can make this water cuz this doesn't really have a source. Oh shit. I never realized how close these waters were together. But I think they're at a different level. That doesn't matter. I can make more water here. Like this entire thing could be a river. Although it'd be harder to navigate around there. This could be a big bridge over it. But yeah, you gotta weigh convenience. Because if I wanna go over there, I'm not gonna wanna go over a huge bridge for my man-made inconvenience, my man-made river. I guess you don't need a river for a big bridge. It's like an, I think, imagine like an archway, like possibly from here or possibly coming up from higher from up there, like right there. Just kind of like a U or something. I kind of like, like shoot out and have like some supports you know maybe arch supports sounds like this would be a pain in the ass yeah I think if it was just lower it's more sensible but you don't want it to take too much visual space or if it does you want it to like look really good and not block like looking at this, I guess. But it can also break up the monotony of how long and straight that is. And I could just talk about that forever, so I'll just keep going here. Do you fancy design? Let's just design together. It's jam bra. This is my old pumpkin patch. Got consumed by this tentacle. But now I have potatoes in the water. I guess it's ripe time to collect potatoes, isn't it? Yes. Fido, would you f help me fetch potatoes? No? Alright. I'll just keep at it then. Wow, I wonder how many potatoes. Well, I got nearly 150. I don't know how much, just around that much. No, don't need the potato. Okay. My, my character's really hungry, I'm sorry. He eats raw potatoes when he's really freaking starving. 